Hunter, what do people need to know as they get ready to begin their weekend? A wonderful weekend is on tap, guys. It will be warm, so you will not need any additional layers because it's going to be right around 80 degrees for high temperatures today, tomorrow, even through Monday. To start out, we're rather chilly, many of us into the 50s and 40s. Right now it is 52. Looking to the east there, the sun's starting to rise over Highway 52. In terms of our temperatures, we're holding on into the 40s for a lot of us. Cresco, New Hampton, Decorah, Zambroda, Albert Lee, and Forest City at those 40s right now. Everyone else into the 50s. Light jacket needed this morning, but if you're going to be going on a walk, it'll be fine. We're going to climb up steadily to those 60s by around 10, 70s by around lunchtime at noon with sunshine for everybody. So we're going to have a wonderful day today, cooling off just enough by the time football games will be kicking off this evening to those low 70s with light winds. Couldn't ask for a better forecast for football games today. In terms of the next couple of days though, yeah, we're going to be hovering right around 80 degrees. So I've noticed some leaves falling out of the trees, laying on the ground. If you have enough to start raking, well, it'll be a wonderful next stretch of days to do so. I'll be a little bit warm, so make sure you're drinking plenty of water to stay hydrated as we hover right around 80 through this weekend. It's all thanks to high pressure that is building in out of the west today and throughout the next couple of days. This will gradually start to dissipate heading into next week and that will open up the door for a cold front to come through by Monday evening and that'll give us strong northwest winds and much, much cooler air as we head into Tuesday of next week, possibly from Wednesday and Thursday as well. In terms of plans to so go up north, you are fine and dandy. We're going to see sunshine for everybody. Today, tomorrow and Sunday, temperatures climbing to those low to mid 70s. Once again, a nice forecast. Now, do have a flannel alert out as we head into Tuesday and Wednesday with high temperatures after that front slipping into the low to mid 60s and then eventually climbing to those upper 60s with sunshine on Wednesday. Hopefully we'll see some rain from this because yeah, we do have some abnormally dry conditions and even some moderate drought out for North Iowa, Winnesheek and Chickasaw counties in that designation of a moderate drought. So hopefully we get some rain in terms of the next seven days. Yeah, it's warm for the first half, but rather chilly for the second half. 63 on Tuesday, 69 on Wednesday, and maybe heading into next weekend, guys. We are monitoring another chance for some decent amounts of rain as another cold front could push in. We certainly need that rain. Mm -hmm. All right, see what happens. Thanks, Hunter.